all right boys and girls in this video I'm going to show how you clean these shrimp that we caught last night this is the second bowl that I caught last night uh, about two and a half gallons almost three and the smaller shrimp like these ones that are three and a half four inches long um, they're going to go into these baggies and that's what I'm going to use for bait throughout the year and these bigger ones that are five and six inches long like these they go over here and when I start to clean them the heads will go in there and the shell will go in there these are my tools of the trade this is for the smaller shrimp and this is for the larger shrimp also I'm catching the the smaller crabs as they're floating by also not the bigger ones just the smaller ones and I'm going to use those for uh, black drum and sheep's head when I get out to start to fishing again but for now I'll just go ahead and start and keep sorting these and bagging them up for bait and sorting them out for cooking I'll get back to you when I start to clean these things properly as I'm going through these you know it's nice to uh, be able to bag up all these shrimp bags and bags and bags 15 18 bags of shrimp God has provided for me to be able to go fishing with and you know it's nice to be able to pick up one every once in a while that's that big that's nice that's good that's a good bite right there and it's nice to pick up one a little bit bigger and then you know a little bit bigger and then you come across little Brutus here you have about three or four of these that size now that's a meal mm. <laughs> all right step number two you separate the heads from the tails of the shrimp throw the heads in there with some other debris that I caught and put the good eating tail over there some people use a tin can and pop the heads, pop the heads, pop the heads like that, like that That's this is the next phase separating the head from the tail it's work but it's worth it I'll get back to you when I'm done okay as I'm finishing up here these are the heads. Some people keep them for chum. That would probably be a smart idea. I haven't done it yet. But also, what I'm going to do is freeze them up. Because you don't want to throw these in the trash unless tomorrow is trash day for you. Because, whoo, they stink. So I'm going to put them in a plastic grocery bag. And put them in the freezer. i got a freezer out on my back porch. That's got nothing but bait in it and then I will when it gets close to trash day I will throw them out in the trash all right this is the next phase on the larger if I had a whole bunch of really nice big shrimp I would use this but I don't have a lot of huge shrimp and 90 90 percent of my shrimp I use the smaller one a deveining tool what you do is you stick it in the mud vein like that I like to have my water running a little bit push it back like that see how it opens up Woo, man so easy in the mud vein push it look at there oh man oh man Somebody invented a smart thing when they invented this thing. Look at that. See that? Deveining tool. You can get them at Publix. Just a buck or two. And it really saves you a lot of hard work and energy. You can put these in the, on the stove quicker. Alright. I'll get back to you. 
Oh, one more thing. The reason I haven't been putting any videos up of the shrimping yet, and I might try it tonight, because I think we're going to go out tonight again. I know we're going to go out tonight again. Um, the water's been murky, and the shrimp, even if they're uh, six or seven inches below the surface, they're hard to see. You can see them, uh, but just barely. So that's the reason I haven't been doing any videos. If the water would clear up, I'd do a lot more videos of the shrimping. But I might try it tonight. Hope so. All right, <clears throat> just about all done, guys and gals. This is going out to the freezer, then to the trash. Just like that. Tie this bad boy up so that the well, the water doesn't get sucked out and then get on the freezer coils. And tonight, we're going to have shrimp, trigger fish, and porgy. So I'm going to have fish and shrimp. Me and my honey bun are going to have fish and shrimp tonight. Praise the Lord. <laughs>